Hello my beautiful tulips, I hope that you guys are all having a fantastic week. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a speed build of this area and I'm really really excited for you guys to see this area and how it turned out. So this speed build, it's a little different just because I'm going to be doing a little voiceover slash not a voiceover so i'm going to be talking in future me and i'm also going to be talking in present me so right now i'm talking in future me but okay let's go ahead and get this speed build started i have a lot of questions for you guys so i decided to change my path into this one instead of like the green one i don't know if you guys remember it but it's like a few videos back where i did like a speed build or it might have been like an, a little mini island tour okay so i ended up changing it to this path but i don't know how i feel about it i don't know i'm kind of iffy let me know if you guys liked my old path better or if you guys like this path better but we're gonna go ahead and start with the tree over here. I just kind of want to get an idea of how I'm gonna start this build. So I'm gonna go ahead and start off with this path just to see what kind of space I have to work with. That's what I love to do. <laughs> That's what I love to do is I like to kind of just add my path and see like how much space I have to work with. And I don't want to make this path very thick i just want it to be natural and flowy but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and stop talking here and i'll see you guys in the next clip okay so here i am just basically adding the last to the path and also if my audio sounds different so like it'll kind of like go to one audio then i will like switch back to the other audio it's because i'm using two different audios i'm using two different apps and i'm hoping that this video isn't really bad also i kind of just noticed that this length over here is gonna be pretty wide if i do say so myself hopefully it doesn't look weird so right now i'm just connecting everything and i don't know if i mentioned this earlier because this is going to be two different audios One's going to be a voiceover and one's going to be a, a like a kind of like a let's play, like a lifetime. So this one's the real one. This is the, um, this is not the imposter. This one is the, um, real audio. This is not the fake one. So here I'm just kind of, yeah, that, that looks, that looks horrible. I, I don't know what I was thinking right there. Um you know i'm just you know oh my goodness like is is my brain having a brain fart like how how do i not know i don't know how to place path i don't know how to place a path would it be like the same one right here right here yeah but then this kind of bothers me like that looks weird like how yeah i don't know i don't i don't know if i'm vibing with that i think maybe i can try no i think i might have to go with that little plain one this one right here it just looks awkward do you get me like it just looks weird and then then i do that and then that looks weird so how would i fix this mistake Okay, so maybe if I, maybe, just maybe, if I maybe cut it short, no, it'll look weird too. Um, I think it's, I'm just like having a like really bad brain fart and I don't know what I'm doing. I placed paths, I'm really, oh my goodness, does anybody just like, the urge of angerness, if that's a word, get to you like when you do that, like I just placed a path and it just it wants it, it like has other plans. Like can you can you not? So maybe I figured out maybe I am a master at placing paths. Look at that. Okay, so basically here I just uh fixed the path. It looks a little weird and it kind of looks a bit too wide it looks really weird it's not the path it's me 
I don't know what's what's going on here. I don't have any more slots to add more codes. I feel like this little area is just kind of like missing like something. It's missing like a like a kind of a little separation. Maybe. Maybe I'll get rid of one of the codes and replace it or something, but I don't know which code I'm willing to give up. I, I don't know. These codes are so cute. I wouldn't know which one to. Yeah. Okay, anyways, I think I might be going back to speed build me. Speed build me. <laughs> speed build me. So I will catch you in speed build me. So I have might have lied and you're not talking to speed belt me you're gonna talk to kind of with me okay so here i'm just going to start decorating with this plastic bench and i thought this was so cute so i kind of was debating if i wanted to add like some fairy lights behind i'll kind of give you guys a little like look at it like maybe you guys have a different opinion of mine but i don't know you know so we are going to go ahead and start adding some potential things so i wanted to add maybe like a tree over here to kind of just cut that awkwardness like from this like little area so i'm gonna go ahead and do that i'm just gonna go ahead and start planting trees where i feel like they will look nice so here i'm just planting a bunch of trees and i'm going to be adding a couple of decorations i really love how this little centerpiece looks and I want to give this build some height as well, so I added some windmills and trees to give it that height. And I really wanted to add that pop of countryside, so I went with these storefronts. And I just love, love using the storefronts. Like, it just makes a huge difference. And it just gives it that countryside vibe. But yeah, so here I'm just adding a couple of decorations, some wheat fields, and other decorations. I'm also almost done with this island, so if you have any suggestions on what theme I should do, definitely comment down below what theme you guys think I should try next. I haven't done any fairy core, elegant core, kid core. I don't think I've done those. I've done forest core, countryside, spring slash countryside this is my spring slash countryside so i tra try <laughs> time traveled forward and then backwards so i can kind of see like how my trees are going to kind of sprout and i'm kind of liking how it's looking although i'm kind of nervous to add a tree right here and like it won't grow so hopefully when adding a tree here it actually grows so it can kind of cover like this awkward back area then i have like a bunch of things that i want to add i want to add probably this cruiser cruiser bike this is kind of cute right like maybe if it's facing the other way it'll look cute let's see why does it face everywhere except where i want it to face like what it what is that maybe if i stand this way it will I will do that how do you guys like the kind of the speed build talk and then popping in in i guess real life <laughs> how do you guys like that kind of like audio i don't know let me know what do you guys think also if you have any suggestions of what i could potentially add to this build you're more than welcome to comment down below what i could add i'm really excited to hear what you guys think so i think in this little area I might add a tiny farm just because I do want to give it that little countryside feeling. Also, if you're getting that feeling of countryside, let me know. I feel like this is a really cool theme to do, but I also feel like I need to know if I'm doing a good job doing that spring core feeling slash, I guess, countryside. Like, let me know. Do you guys think it looks nice? So this is a little area that I'm pretty proud of. I thought this area was so, so cute. But let me know what you guys think. This rug is super cute. If I don't forget, because I usually forget everything. But if I don't forget, I'll leave the code down for that code if you for that coat for the rug if you guys want to use it but yeah let's go ahead and continue so we're gonna go ahead and start working on the final details of this area i wanted to add this little chip bag and i don't know i think they're really really cute and i also wanted to add a bunch of flowers 
and a bunch of wheat fields over here i'm going to make a little farm so i took these rocks down and i'm just gonna go ahead and add some star fronts and i'm gonna add other little decorations like these um decorated bottles and then i'm gonna go ahead and with the designer app and start using the in-game path and this is how it looks and i didn't know what i wanted to do with that area so i decided to move to this area and i added this covered wagon and some fencing as well and i love this fencing it just gives it that spring core vibe and back here i'm just gonna add a bunch of flowers and bushes i just want to make it look a little bit abandoned in a way and i'm gonna go ahead and start adding some crops and i also added a apple tree but i'm gonna go ahead and switch it off to an orange tree and then here i was like wait what what crops did i add and i forgot so i decided to do this like little rug area i don't know why i said rug area i meant to say a sitting area but yeah, I'm just pretty much adding the final details, so I'm gonna go ahead and stop talking here as I've been talking throughout this whole video, and I hope that you guys enjoy the rest of this video, and I hope that you guys are relaxing, and you guys are eating your snacks, and staying, staying, staying hydrated. But yeah, I'll see you guys when I'm going to give you guys the final walkthrough of this area. As always i will be giving you guys a final walkthrough of this area also if you hear my loud computer in the background please please forgive my computer it is super loud and i tried everything to make it less loud but i think i made it even louder so i'm just going to leave it like that and hope that you guys don't hear it so if we go ahead and walk over here to this bridge i just love already the waterscaping it is so cute and i love it so if we go ahead and take this bridge, we are over here in my little villager area and I'm really proud of this build. It took me I think, I think like 3 hours to build, maybe 4, but it was totally worth it. I love everything, I love the little trees, I love the flowers, but anyways to this left side we have this villager home and I wanted to keep it pretty simple so I just added a couple of items, I added the stacked box and this wood storage i think that's what it's called and then over here we do have a little not a little a giant vine and we have a couple of wheat fields everywhere and in this little middle what is wrong with my vocabulary in this little middle area we do have this cute little centerpiece we have some wheat fields we have this delicious pie and back over here, we do have a little abandoned storefront. We have some flowers and what are these called again? I forgot what they're called. Glowing moss. And I wanted to keep my houses pretty simple. So I just added a couple of furniture. For this area, we, add, we added a storefront and some cookies. And I just love this little back area, how it's full with all of these trees and wheat fields and flowers. I thought that was super cute. If we go ahead and come to this right side, we have this like little sitting area. And I thought this was so cute. It's right behind my river. And I just love this. I love the colors. I love that countryside feeling slash spring court. I love it. Let me know if you guys are getting the vibes from this island like a spring core slash countryside like let me know and then to this right side we have a tiny farm and this is actually really really cute look at the little details like the tomatoes are green and they're gonna go ahead and turn red and i love this look at the rotten 
the rotten what are these called again oh my goodness what are these called turnips it's like alone and abandoned back there and then over here we just have a tree and i love all of the little details that i was able to incorporate but yeah that's pretty much it i'm really really happy how this area turned out i hope that this video gave, gave you either motivation or inspiration if you guys like animal crossing content like this i hope that you guys subscribe and if you like to support me like this video and comment down what area was your favorite if you guys like all of the flowers or what did you guys like let me know but yeah i hope you guys have a safe and lovely week be safe be kind and i'll see you guys next time bye my beautiful tulips